Okay. This is, uh, yeah, definitely gonna be the, the finale to this, I think. I, I can't imagine that I, uh, I won't finish this today. Anyway, if you're watching this later on YouTube, thanks for clicking the video. Hope you've been enjoying this so far. I know I have. This is one of my favorite games. It's growing up. Not of all time, but you know. It puts a smile on my face. Uh, Alright, let's start with here. I'm gonna have to find the alt path here. Oh. So there is an alt path in this stage. See, I was kind of thinking that when I got here. But I wasn't 100% certain. It did kind of feel like this. if any stage was going to do it, it was going to be this one. But okay, noted. trying to think, like, where would it be? It definitely has to, I have to look at some path that's inaccessible. It's gonna be like a specific series of switch maneuvers. Can't remember if I ever went up there. Oh, there's a door. Okay. So that's the door that I don't want to go through. to take him out. Alright, it doesn't matter. Okay, so this has already reversed the flow. Alright, so I mean... I just want to see where this leads, if anywhere. has to be through this door then. No look, there's something there. Oh. Did I get this last time? I don't remember. something. Hmm. 
trying everything. Oh, this is the mini game. Okay, this is fine. I guess this is just to get out. I wonder if this is a thing. Because usually when it does that sprite thing at the bottom, it means there's something down there. Like, it does, it's not doing it here. No, but I guess it's a different floor type. Maybe I'm just imagining it. But I do remember that's how I used to check, was like, oh, you could see the floor shake in a particular way. It's over there. I think. But to get through that, we need to be able to roll or something. Alright, we'll see. Ah! <laughs> what am I doing? Has to be that spot down there. Just okay. How do you get down there? There has to be like a lower path somewhere. <laughs> when in doubt. There's no enemy to grab either to be able to throw. At least not that I can see. Like you can't grab those window dudes. Oh no. I didn't mean to do that. Path still feels off to me, but like, why would they want you to crawl under here? There is definitely an alternate exit in the stage, I just have to find it. Hot. 
Okay, so now... I would imagine there's a fake wall somewhere. Do they... Okay, they do, they do. I think this is the answer. Let me just make sure that it's not like a fake wall here or something. <laughs> no, come on, there has to be a reason why, why I'm allowed to bring this dude here. giving up. Ah, oh, it's okay. I'll, I'll reset the room. I really don't remember this. Like, the last time I played this, I think I was 10. Okay, let me have a look. The only th other thing I can think of is... But that would be like a lengthy thing to have to do. Bring it all the way here and then... Nah, there's no way. It can't be that. Okay, okay, there it is. This has to be it. Yep, there's the sound. Thanks for the raid. How's it going? Yeah, finally. <sighs> I don't have to do the puzzle either. It's been done. <sighs> okay. Time for path one. So what does this entail? Just a potato at the moment, aren't we all? <laughs> no, come on, that's not how that works. All the other ones, they don't speed it up. Okay. So I guess this arc goes into the factory even more.
going to have the chef in here. I can, I can feel it. Oh. Oh no. I think I have to get hit on purpose here. No, okay. Ha oh, that's probably an exit. Now that I look at that closer. Don't you dare. Ah! Nintendo has a direct tomorrow. I'm kind of surprised. Usually this time of year, it's like, oh, Switch Pro or like Game Boy on their service thing. And if they weren't so much like Disney, they sh they could have released Game Boy stuff on the Switch already. Then I I wouldn't have to be doing what I'm doing now. How about I, yep, pay attention. Don't, no. Oh my god. This is the fish thing all over again. Probably going to be useful. <laughs> it instantly turned around. I, I waited for it to turn around and everything. Oh, it, I, it worked. I just did it too late. Enough for the bonus stage now, at least. Wait, why is that coin different? I'm not going to say anything. They've only been in one other stage, and I completely forgot they existed. That might just be a coincidence, but there might be something below. Ah, that... 
Why does Wario have to be so big? That's just going to do the same as the left side. Oh, hello. Alright. sure. Crap. This might be the first time I fail it. Uh... I, I mean, I, it's, it's between two of them, but I'm not 100% certain. Like, I, I kind of think it's one of these two. Maybe... They don't catch up properly. Remember if you can do this again if you fail it. You know? Which one was it? Like, I. F My eye was like up here. I feel like it's one of these bottom ones. I'm leaning towards this one, but I'm not certain. Like, I think it's between any one of these three. Which one? Top row, second from the right? That one? Okay. Yeah, see, I was wrong. <laughs> I was wrong. I would've, I would've gotten that completely wrong. That's only the second time that's happened to me. Every other time I've gotten it. This game's so cracked, forgot how crazy it is. Oh no, it's great. Hey Carlos, you ever remember that there was a stage with a chicken that you had to rescue? I don't. <laughs> just. Do you want to talk about weird? Like, just look, look at an image for Warriors pet chicken. It only appears in this game, so that's why. But I don't remember it. You barely remember anything from the game. Yeah, let's just say that Warriors chicken has a little too many human features. And leave it at that. And I was not expecting it, because I... In my mind, it didn't exist. I just don't remember it at all, but... No, this game is great. Because you don't die in it. It's just, uh... You just keep retrying things. There's no death. Okay, here we go. <sighs> See, it, it could have been a six or a two. That's why I had to wait. There we go. Hopefully I have enough coins to get it done. You do not remember this chicken? Yeah, it was a thing and... 
I mean, thankfully I wasn't seeing things like, uh, chat kind of agreed that it had, uh, too many human proportions. Is it her wings or is it actually a bosom? No, the, the chicken has boobs. The sprite work, like, quite clearly they, they gave it boobs. don't like the stage. Wait, what was the point in this? This, this is a dead end. I have to go back. I'm going to lose all the coins I gained. <laughs> this, this was not worth it. I'm gonna be worse off. Dude. Okay, that's that's the ticket right there. Was this the start of the level? I may have just come back to the start of the level. Ah! Yeah, I think I just came back to the start of the level. Let's see if there's anything at the bottom. No. I guess don't do that again! <laughs> okay. Don't you dare. I know, I know what this is about. I have to get through this without getting hit. got launched. Uh, let's see. Okay. Alright. Game face on, I got this. Okay. I'm not even going to attempt to do it on the hard just to save money. It's just not worth it. I remember it being super quick. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Well, there's the end of the stage. Okay, so I do have to get crushed on purpose. <laughs> okay. I have no idea where I am. I 
Okay. Yeah, we're, we're in the right room. I kind of paid attention. Oh no, this is gonna suck. I'm gonna have to do this multiple times. It's hard to control. so hard to slide into some of these. What? <laughs> I guess I just have to go immediately right. Or maybe I just have to be on the left side to begin with. So immediately, right. Nah, but see, it just it just makes you go left. So I think I have to end up on the left side, because then I can make the first direction go to the right. And just stay there. I think I have to slide into that first gap. Why does this have to be so tricky? Yeah, there's no there's no way I can do it that way. It has to be from the left. I'm gonna be here a while. I wish I could convey how hard it is to do that. See, the moment I go off, it just goes straight to the left. I can't adjust it. It's a good thing there's no time limit in this game. Trying to do that, like, just 
jump and then... <sighs> I wonder if I can go across all the way, maybe, and jump from the right side. I'll try it. I don't think you can. I think it prevents you from jumping too high, so I have to do it from this side. Okay, hang on. Maybe this. No. Nah. <laughs> this is so. This is so frustrating. Especially since I know 10-year-old me would have been able to do this, probably. First try. The jump strat is the way, what, like... Jumping and then doing that. Crap. Oh my! Ah. <laughs> okay. Well, cool. I guess that worked out for me. <laughs> Alright. Wait, no! Oh, what have I done? <laughs> I thought I could keep going. <laughs> Oh, yeah, do it and then have to do it again. Ugh, I wasn't paying attention. I thought I could go back for those other coins. I was tunnel visioning the coins that I left behind like an idiot. <laughs> what did I what did I even do? I just walked off the edge and then kinda was like, oh no, whoops. Okay, there we go. Okay, okay. I've got this part down now. Okay, so I guess I have to climb all the way up again. That was just the answer. I think I have to go across here and then... Or do I have to avoid... No, I have to avoid it. Okay. And then I have to... Oh boy, that one's gonna be fun. Okay. See, once you know, it's not that bad. I have no idea how this is gonna go. So close.
I didn't jump in time. <sighs> I need to get rid of that thing. Don't. No, please. I, I just want to get the level done. Okay, but no! <laughs> okay, okay. That was an accident again. I, okay, it doesn't matter, stage is done. I thought I had to jump, but falling off again. Okay, cool. Oh, that was so stressful. One or seven. I just need a, a left tile, please. There we go. Okay. Getting there. Why have this stage been so much harder than the other ones? Okay, there's nothing here. Okay, hold on. Well, I mean, that's all well and good. Oh, it's just that. There's no way this isn't anything. Pick him up. Hold on. Okay, there was nothing. Ah, uh, uh-oh. I messed up. multiple things going on here.
surprised that's not a thing. As long as I have a hundred coins, All right, that's fine now. That's all I need to do the normal version of the bonus stage. What is this? Oh, I see what's gonna happen. Before I do that... Aha! bounce off it. I still need to. What? No, 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 no. And they have to bounce off you. There we go. my sign of the bonus stage. <laughs> no, <laughs> I probably shouldn't have done that. It's okay. There's a backup one. Uh, Alright, that's the end of the stage, which I don't want yet. How am I supposed to do this? I think I need to move it. Stop! <laughs> yeah, I need to move it. Okay. Come here. No! Warrior's just too chunky. Okay, it's all right. All right, so here I can control myself. Okay, I need to do it sooner. But that is the idea. Except that achieves nothing. <laughs> okay, so hang on. If I do go in there, there's no way back out for me. At least I don't think so. No, there's a platform there. All right, we're cool. Okay. 
Okay. Right, so this lowered this. This is the bonus stage, isn't it? Yep, alright, cool. Thought bottom left initially, but man, you gotta be quick at that one. Okay, the stage wasn't that bad. This was fine. be multiple numbers, it's a three. Okay. It could have been a nine, actually, now that I see that, but it's okay. All right. Oh, it's an owl stage. So this is just a maze. <laughs> it's just all this is gonna be. I'm not gonna go straight for the goal. I, I will collect coins, because I need them. Yeah, this stage is gonna go for a while. I'm not going to touch the doors yet until I have 100 coins, at least. There we go. Well, oh, it wasn't the bonus stage. Alright, cool, that's, uh, yep. <laughs> oh no. Okay, I can climb back up, that's fine. Platforms are in the way. Wait, was, was that it? Just to collect the coins, that's it. Nothing else. Well, there's an arrow going this way. Oh, no! <laughs> Wait, yes! <laughs> Happy accident. Oh, it's time to be fat. <laughs> yes! This is the best transformation. I think here I 
should have avoided it by the looks of it. Like, it's the opposite. Don't you dare. Okay. Just another coin room. So this is where I got hit, anyway. Right, I'm going this way. I mean, I, I want to find the bonus stage first. Okay, I mean, this is cool now that I know where it is. But I'm not doing it. Hang on, there's something up here. Wait, what? <laughs> what did I just do? Ah! Okay, hang on. I don't know how I did that. I was just trying to crouch. I love it when I do something first try and then when I try to do it again. Nope. That'll do. Oh cool, alright, yeah, we can leave now. I wasn't sure. Wait, is that a Metroid? I think I just got a Metroid as a prize. Seems very likely it's a five. Okay. Down to the last six stages. The last stage of this path. Oh, that was fortunate. <laughs> Already a hundred coins. I think I had to avoid... Potentially, I'm not sure. Yeah, see, once it's like this, it's hard to... Ooh, 
Oof. Okay. But now I, I guess it's a maze. Now I go this way. Turn that on. Yes. Now I have to come this way. Hey, turn around. Oh, you know what? I can bring you with me. That'll do. Oh, this is this is just a a dead end room anyway. All right, we're done. I got most of the coins. Wait, but then. It was fine to go that way. No! Surprise, none of them hit me. <laughs> hey, Laura. How'd you go? Oh, wait, I can't fix this. This is. <laughs> this is touch. It was like that stage touch fuzzy, you get dizzy, except it's permanent. We went to a Japanese sake bar. Nice. It's cool. Get out of here. Alright. Okay, hang on. Come here. Other way. Other way. Other way. Other way. Other way. Oh. Can I reach this? Surely. I'm holding up. No, I think it's just slightly too high. What is this room? Oh, okay, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Is this two of them? <laughs> oh no, what have I done? <laughs> what have I done? That's not what I was trying to do. I was trying to bring it here, bounce off. Yeah, this is, this is a process right here. Okay, try again. Wait, really a nice guy, but 95% is your brother with the same mannerisms. Oh. Okay. Yeah, I mean, that can't be good in the interest of romance, I guess. Hey! Just... Okay, up you go. 
Where's the other one? I don't want to despawn this one. Where's the other one? Can I just get here normally? No. games and the despawns. Oh my god. It's alright, I can despawn. I think. Okay. I can't... Whoa! Oh! Okay, fuck me then, huh? <laughs> <laughs> There's another power that I- I've never gotten this power in the entire playthrough of this. Okay. What? I didn't associate it with that. So, do you mean to tell me all these other times where I've like... I've done this very convolutedly. All those other times I had to get to high ground, which I did! I could have just done this. Okay. Yep. <laughs> it's okay. Oh, no, we can't go in there yet. We haven't found the bonus stage, but that's where it is. Okay. I didn't think it would be this first one. I need to find out which one it is. Okay. Maybe second last? Wait, it looks like there's a box here. Why? Yeah, it's here. There we go. And now we just chill here. Yes! Oh, I just caught that. Good. Alright. I guess all that remains is the boss room, unless I really want to get all these coins. Which, I mean, I guess it couldn't hurt to get these ones at least. Yeah, cool. Just a big one will do. Hey, made it. This is like. A, ah! <laughs> Damn it. Already? I was gonna say this is like a Sonic the Hedgehog type fight. That just gave me the same vibes. I can't believe it got me that quickly. I guess that's my consolation prize. It's actually not that bad of a backtrack. It's just here. Alright, I got this. Alright, it's just this. <laughs> I had to jump. I don't want to lose more coins. If I can keep them, I'll be happy. Yep, good job. I pressed dash! 
Oh my god, stop. <laughs> I'm over I'm over complicating it. Okay. What no what? <laughs> what is this fight? Losing so many coins. Okay, 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 okay. Jeez. What now? I get the feeling I have to step on this. Okay, I see, I see. Yes! Nah, miss. Ah, oh, faked me out. <laughs> okay. Almost had her. What? How did- oh, I can't believe that missed. Holy crap, Wario is so slow at picking up the bomb. Like, it takes one whole second to pick it up and then you can't wind it up immediately. Oh, I can't get it to wind up. I'm... Okay, wait. Now- I'm being too impatient, I feel like it's gonna explode. Okay, I, ju I just have to try, that's all. Gotcha. Okay. Why'd I jump? Ah, <laughs> oh, this fight. Path has kind of been nightmarish. Here we go. No! Oh. The radius of that is just so massive. Or well, Warrior is just too big. One or the other. And once she hits you once, like, that's it. You, you can't recover from it. It really doesn't give you much of a window to avoid that! Oh my god. No! No! <laughs> 
I hate this stage. I hate it. What, why? Why didn't I? What? What? What is she doing? What? <laughs> what is she doing? I've lost over a hundred coins, it's coming back to the boss stage. Okay. Yep, good, good job. Man, I'm not playing well. I think I'm just a little tired. This is the one I'm gonna get it this time. Just you watch. What? No, come on, I landed on it. I got the opener right, it's just I didn't land on the bomb properly. That's a shame, she wasn't in range. <laughs> I can't believe that. I was... Uh, I was hoping that it would do the upper one so I could dodge it, but no, both times it was a lower one. I've come to terms with the fact that I've lost most of my money, so it's okay. believe that missed <sighs> I think this is definitely the hardest path of the ones that I've done so far oh 
Like, as far as the last boss goes, damn. One. Two. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, you dick. I'm not gonna get it. She was just not in position. So why did I do that? Oh, I didn't wind it up. So sad. I need a drink of water. Oh, I, I almost had it. <laughs> that was it. Fucking Wario. Oh, I don't know. Forgot to say, I found a copy of Paper Mario on GameCube for a fair price, and so now I own that game. So I'm probably gonna play it at some point this year. Really? I haven't played that one. I think it's the one that I haven't played. How much? Like, I don't want people to hate me, so I'm not going to say it, but it wasn't eBay prices. That is all. Maybe it was your copy that accidentally went to Vinny's. Yeah, and then ended up in Melbourne somehow. Makes perfect sense to me. It's just one of those things, right place at the right time, that's all. <laughs> I hate this boss! <laughs> I'm so frustrated. <laughs> I'm getting tilted at this. Say that you cried to that about it. You did. You've mentioned that. Maybe you should make it like a, a prerequisite. If you're dating someone, just be like, has to own a copy of Thousand Year Old Door. So then, if things really go well, then you own a copy eventually too. Be a weird prerequisite. Oh, I keep falling for it. But there's no tell for it, it's just random. It's not telegraphed, it's just, nope, sometimes it'll do that. I guess I should just not jump. It's 
probably my problem is I'm just jumping when I shouldn't be. He's just so bulky. His movements. It takes far too long to grab that bomb as well. Like, it takes him... Like, at least 1.5 seconds, and then to wind up the charge as well, it's the same. It's, it's kind of messed up. It just doesn't give you enough time to be able to aim it. Does it say final boss? It is a final boss, not the final. I don't think there's such a thing as the final boss. Like, the way this game works is there's just branching paths that you can take, and each of them has an ending, so... This is the ending of this path. that not hit. Dude. I think the thing that frustrates me is just you don't have enough time to line up the shot. There we go. so frustrating. Oh my god. That was lucky. Oh, and then there's that as well. There's no indicator of when the bomb's gonna go rogue like that. It's just random. I tried waiting and it did go a bit better, but still... for the best. One. Oh, you please stop doing that. Sucked. I got a Game Boy for my treasure. I broke Jesus' teacup. You know that Jesus has boobs, right? Like, if you're saying that's Jesus. That's a four? Just making sure it wasn't a 9. Could have been a 9 as well. Mm. 
Hooray. Five stages remain. Watch Wario punt them out of the building. This was definitely the hardest path. Oh, there's a redeem for the real thing. Oh, yes! I think this one has the same ending as others. We'll see. He's just walking back. The music is good. Yeah, it's great. There's a reason this was one of my favorite games as a kid. I mean, everything about it. It's a really solid Game Boy game. I mean, it still, still holds up. And I'll still say, like, if you've never played the series, it's worth playing. I mean, Warrior Land 1 is a bit different. It's closer to Mario than, than anything, but it does have its unique spin. But this is where they figured, no, give, uh... Give Wario his own, like, personality and... I just love that he can't die, he's just unstoppable, and he doesn't get power-ups, he just gets injured to the point where he can progress. It's, uh, it's great. Okay, so we've got one more path to do, and then this game is done. So. Not sure what, what, what awaits. What game do I think I'll do next? Uh, I'm gonna continue the Zelda game, so I'm gonna play... What do you mean today? Today is Stardew. I'm gonna... I'm finishing Wario and I'm finishing Stardew today, but like... Once I'm done with Wario... I'm gonna start playing the Zelda games. So... I was going through all of them in chronological order of release. So then when the new game releases this year, I'll have played them all. With the exception of one that's, like, really hard to acquire, and it's kind of a pain to play. So, I'll be skipping one of them. Which one? Uh, the GameCube one. The one that requires four Game Boy Advances to play properly. I mean, you can get away with one, but, like, it was designed to be a multiplayer game. Uh, Four Swords Adventures. So. It's hard to find a copy of it, so this is... I've, I've been playing all of these legit, just so you know. Like, I have a way of playing every single Zelda game to date, except one. On real hardware, which is what I've been doing. So. I guess that's, that's the thing. Um, that one. The game is rare to begin with. So it's expensive. And then on top of that, you need a Game Boy Advance, which I guess technically with this thing I can use it, but it's still... How am I hooking up Game Boy Color to this? Um, well, there's this thing called the Analog Pocket, which is a piece of hardware that plays all Game Boy, Game Boy Advance, Game Boy Color cartridges, and does it in a really nice presentation. It's not emulation at all, it's... Like, what is it called? FPGA. If you're interested, look it up. But yeah, that's how I'm playing it. So. I mean, just to prove the point, I would like pull out the cartridge now, but like, I don't want to destroy it. But it's a very nice piece of hardware. I was, uh, 
on the couch playing Pokemon Puzzle League on it. And man, the screen on it is just so good. Um, but the way I played the Game Boy ones previously to this, I have the Game Boy player for the GameCube. So I would hook up the GameCube and then put the Game Boy cartridge in the Game Boy player. The only problem with that was like the picture wasn't the best quality and the D-pad on the GameCube controller is not great. So I'm going to continue with the uh, Oracle of C... no, Ages. Oracle of Ages is what I'm up to. Oh, I have to give it a reset. Hold on, chat. See, the one I'm using a Super Nintendo controller, and it's great. The only thing is it doesn't have, like, a menu button, so I have to, like, pull this out of the dock. And then go quick cartridge. Play cartridge. Play. But yeah, listen. Just so you know, it's coming out of a device. Back into the dock you go. See? Real hardware. <laughs> Bait weren't expecting that. Uh, I'm not sure if this is an alternate path or a standard path. Um, also, uh, sorry Laura, I missed the comment, but... The Nintendo Direct is tomorrow morning at 9am our time, I believe. If you go to the YouTube live stream, it'll give you an exact countdown, but I believe it's either at 8 or 9 in the morning out time. Which, they haven't talked about it, but like, okay, a couple things happened today. One, Amazon accidentally put up pre-orders for Metroid Prime 4, which is a game that ever since announcement they have shown nothing of. So that's kind of gotten my hopes up a little, <laughs> which... I mean, I expect to be disappointed. It doesn't exactly confirm that they're gonna talk about the game, but... Now I kind of have an expectation that they will, but... I doubt they will. And the other thing is, um... A Tears of the Kingdom, the pre-order went up. Accidentally again. And, uh... Well, the game is... If the pricing was US pricing, basically it suffered the same fate as other AAA games where the price has increased by $10, so the game is more expensive than any other Switch game from Nintendo. So, we'll see, but that one's probably true. As that's something that's been happening across the board, regardless of game studio. This one I, I did this, the alternate path, now that I remember. Hope it'll have a simultaneous digital release. What do you mean simultaneous digital release? Or do you mean like, same release date globally? It's rare that they don't do that. Fairly certain for this is have to go. Same release date for digital and physical. When have they not done that? I mean, Nintendo specifically. Like, I know the practice does exist. But, like, Nintendo. For their basically major game of the year.
I'm still gonna purchase physically because in Australia we have the whole thing where it's cheaper to buy physical copies than it is digital. For one. Like, you usually save anywhere between $20 to $30. It's kind of... kind of stupid. And then, the other thing is I just... I just don't trust Nintendo when it comes to digital purchases yet. I've said the reasons before, but pretty much it's... it comes down to, like... Okay. I bought stuff on my PS3. Digitally. Those games that I purchased, I still have access to on my P PlayStation account. More or less. Alright. There are a couple exceptions, but for the most part, the games that I purchased with Sony, yeah, I mean, if I go there, they're still there. Nintendo, on the other hand, I purchased stuff for the Wii, that's it, they're gone, can't re-download them. Um, and they're locked to that console, so it's not like if I got another Wii I'd be able to download them. Nope. They were locked to that console. And then when the 3DS came out, they were like, Oh yeah, you know those games that you bought? Um... Yeah, you know, you can buy them again on the eShop. Oh, I bought them on the Wii. Can I, can I, uh, have them for the 3DS? No, you have to buy them again. And it's kind of the same thing. Nintendo just... I don't trust them when it comes to digital stuff, I'm sorry to say. Like, they have no track record. Like, the storefronts eventually shut down and then you lose access to your stuff. I just... yeah. Am I playing basketball here? Oh no! Oh, I see how this works. <laughs> I don't remember this stage. Oh, come on! Anyway, that that's why I won't purchase stuff digitally. I mean, if you were to if Australia were to one day have its physical versus digital pricing stuff fixed, I still would go physical on Nintendo. And I would recommend anyone that wants to be able to play their games in future without any hassle. Like let's say, I don't know, ten years down the line. Um yeah, don't buy them digitally from them. It's just, it's not, it's not really a thing. They just have no track record of, um, allowing you to be able to access your digital purchases into the future. They want you to buy their games again, and again, and again, and again. Or, I guess these days, subscribe to their, like, uh, service. The other thing is, some games, I mean... They go an absolute eternity before they make them available to for purchase in their digital stores anyway. I mean, consider this. Honestly, there is no technical reason why Game Boy games should not be on their online service on Switch. The only reason is pretty much just trickle. They want to trickle the stuff. I can't believe I've missed so many times, like... He's allowed to dunk it, but I have to, like, rely on RNG. Like, look at that. that what- what is the measure of- so, Like, I did that right- right? This is- this is kind of annoying. <laughs> kind of janky. There we go. Alright. Down to the home... stretch. There we go, jeez.
Yes. That was definitely the path to take because I haven't done this before. Okay, uh, we're down to the last five levels. Here we go. So what does this path entail? Wait, that's a tower from the first game. Oh, so this is like... The, we're going to their hideout. Maybe this might be the real path that I have to take. Hmm. Her lair kind of reminds me of uh, Wily's... Uh, I don't know, is it a castle? I guess it's a bit of a lair. Wait a minute, haven't I done this stage before? No. It's- it's similar. Uh, but as far as predictions go for the direct, I mean... If the Amazon thing is to be believed, then... Hey, we might hear about Metroid Prime 4. But, realistically, this is what's going to happen. 90% certain this is going to happen. They're going to talk about Kirby, because that's coming out in a couple of weeks, and they're probably going to show quite a bit of that, and that's going to take up five to ten minutes of that direct. Then they're probably going to mention um, Zelda, because that's coming out soon as well. That'll probably be like the extent that you'll see uh, the main games at. And then... Maybe Pikmin, because that's one that's probably closer to being done than Zelda. I mean, sorry, uh, Metroid. That's what I'm expecting, and then just third-party stuff that's coming out soon. I can't imagine it would be any more than that. So that's what I'm expecting. <laughs> I'm not... I'm not gonna go down the path of, like, thinking there's gonna be some surprise. Because the last time that happened, it was like, oh, they, they're finally having a direct. 40 minutes of new stuff? Cool. And then those 40 minutes, like, half of which ended up being farming simulators. So, tempering expectations. Depending on what time it's at, I'll, I, I might either record myself watching it, or... If it's at 8am, I can probably catch it before work and stream it, but I'd have to go right away. So we'll see. Either way, a video will go up on YouTube about it. When I blind watch it. Okay, got it. This is stealth. At least now I can assassinate them. Ah, oh, there was one more. This is an exit, but there's probably a way to get down there. Oh no, what if it's uh... Oh, it doesn't matter. <laughs> there. Oh, there. Oh! There you go. 
There you go. Let's just fall down. Oh, what? I can't believe that reached me. That was probably not worth it. I think I lost more coins than what I gained from that little pocket there. What? <laughs> what did I do differently? What did I do differently? There's nothing here. No, come on, there has to be a way down there. There it is. Oh. But that would mean that there's an equivalent over here. It has to be, yep. I don't think that serves another purpose. Alright. the control. Well, gee, I wonder if there's anywhere I can go in the ceiling. Just a, there it is. Just a matter of where it is. What is it with these characters building structurally weak lairs? Like, Warrior's Castle isn't any better. Nice! Ooh, look at that coin count. Let's try. Okay, hang on. We haven't seen a bonus stage yet. I wonder if this is like hidden fire blocks here. Yep, there it is. Normal. Uh, 
this one. Okay, cool. This was a good stage to recover some of that money I've lost. Back up to 3,000. Awesome. There can be several numbers right now. Five or six. That's a six. I love that I lost most of that money <laughs> that I just got. Okay. We are close. Very close. Down. I mean, I know there's a spring power now, but like, I don't think I need it here. I think this is if I get the spring power, it's gonna cause harm. Okay, maybe not there. Maybe there I do need it. Oh, it doesn't respawn. Looks like I go far away enough, maybe? Okay, let's just leave it available. I think I can still do it. Hit me! I'll just chill here. As long as I got the big coin, it's fine. Ooh. Ooh, I see I see the error of my ways. Jumps way too high. Come here. Oh, that's nice. I can just wait. Do that eventually, just not yet. I get the feeling I have to be tiny. Yes! Okay, maybe not. I thought I'd squeeze through here. Wow, this is... Yeah, these are all throwback stages. Okay, nice. 
nice. Bad. Okay, that wasn't too bad. What's in here? What? As if my charge doesn't prevent that. Did I do something I shouldn't have? <laughs> I think I just did something I shouldn't have. Okay, hang on. But then what's the point of the upper path then? Oh, no, I, I think I know what's about to happen. This is going to have a switch as well. Oh, lucky. But the doll's right there. Oh, whatever. No, there has to be a way to do this. I'm gonna try and crouch on my way through this. I, th I can almost... Oh, I did it! <laughs> ha! I wonder how much, like, like, if that's intentional, or if... Maybe I just saved myself some time. It just seems like that's a hard brick wall. Eight. Okay, now it can be five or six. a five. Nearly there. But the thing is... Oh, crap. I'm an idiot. I accidentally went in the stage again. Cool. Alright. That worked. Yes. We're okay. Yeah, so this is... I think this is the true ending, because it's kind of going through... Very similar concepts to previous stages. Ah, 
Oh, whatever. <laughs> I could not see that one coming. Dude, that, that one's really obnoxious. Because you're making the jump and you can't see it coming. I can't tell that it's going to hit me until it's too late. Oh, this is probably not worth it. I tried. I, the thing is, I want the coins. I'm sure there'll be plenty of opportunity to get the coins. Wait, so that's it? Yes, sir. Well, I guess I may as well try and go for the coins now. <sighs> that's... yeah, that's not easy. What? How did that happen? Oh. Okay, got it. to do that. And now do this. That worked. Nice. I wonder if it's possible to soft lock yourself here. So that's it in this room. Guess so. Top 
corner right away and then hit the switch one more time. I haven't found the bonus stage yet, which is a little concerning. Oh, this I have to get hit. I mean, I see it. Interesting. I wonder what this is about. Maybe with the switch. I'll hit the switch again and then come back here. I think that's all it is. If there's anything missing, I'll know it's there. Wow. I've never seen this rely on this before. Oh, come on. Alright, just go. How painful could it be? Oh, cool. Alright, it's here. And I don't have to worry. Set up. This is kind of annoying, not gonna lie. Especially because you have to rely on these rats and. Well, yeah, this. This right here. Unless there's another way. Like, that one's not coming back. And then. I have to do this. I'll just go. This is so annoying. I can't get it to bounce at the angle that I want it to. There we go.
God, we haven't killed all the ducks. Oh. No, I guess that's why it's making the sound, because this is the last one remaining. <laughs> there we go. Five or six. Damn it. Oh, wow, I got it right. <laughs> it's okay. Two more remain. Find the hidden door. Okay. So this is the stage where I'm going to be doing this the entire way through. It would seem. I found a hidden door, I'm not sure it's the hidden door. Feeling this is a yeah, never mind. I mean, this is gonna be a fun stage just from the perspective of destroying everything. almost an unfortunate landing. I haven't found many coins, which is a little concerning. Coins here? There are, okay. I have to collect more coins. Did I not see that? Oh my god. No! I, I can't lose more coins. I 
have to keep these. Oh no, that's not what I want. Okay, I have enough of the bonus stages, need to find it. Hopefully this is it. Alright, good. Second last one. Keeps going. Doesn't look it. This has to be the path down. right now. Eight or zero. I need that middle piece. I need that middle piece. Okay. Yeah, I mean, the map already reveals where it's buried. Like, at this point, you could deduce where it is. <laughs> This is it, final stage. What the? Why is this thing being so aggressive? There we go. Man, I lost all my coins. I'm not sure this is 100% worth it, but I'll try. That's, uh, yep, that's quite the climb. Dude. I have to try and, I have to try and get them. Like, that's not on. I'm gonna lose all my coins otherwise. Okay. 
fine. As long as I got coins, we're okay. Is that beneficial? I can't tell. Sucks, it's just. Ugh. It takes too long to pick him up. I have to. Dis disperse of that one at the very least. It's okay. Kind of. As long as I can pick it up. Oh my god, this is so obnoxious. Figured it would be these dudes. Oh no, I have to carry one of them. Okay, here we go. Oh, um, <laughs> I can't believe I just did that. Okay, here we go. What is, what is wrong with my jump? Did I... Wow. There's an upper area, but I'm not sure how to get to it. Might be that, but it's not. Okay. Well, that's the boss already. Oh no! The okay, that's probably the exit for the the fight. That's what that is. And here's the bonus stage. That doesn't matter. That's all the treasure collected. Ooh. I would imagine being hit with the fire. Yeah, that. <laughs> I kind of figured that would happen. Oh, 
that's not worth the time. If I could jump up there easy, sure, but this is a little bit of a hassle. I'm good. I mean, that's not too bad. It's probably gonna get harder. What? Ooh. No! Oh. So wait, I can't hit it with a bomb, apparently. Do I have to wait for the minion? Probably. Ugh, so close. That didn't work. Oh, that's so, that's so frustrating. I have to wait for the minion again. It's just she keeps throwing bombs. This is gonna be another one of these like just hope to R and Jesus. That was just unfortunate. At least it's fairly quick to get back. Oh no, oh wow. Even that could happen. So if I don't grab it... Ugh. I mean, I could suppose this is a final fight. It's supposed to be tricky. slows down. Oh. Dude, this, oh, this is so obnoxiously annoying. There has to be something I need to do with this bomb. I haven't figured it out. Nope, that's gonna catch on fire, let it go. <laughs> the 
this is the part that I don't get. It's just timing or what? Like I've hit it directly with it before. And it does nothing, it just bounces off. Maybe I just have to hit her multiple times. That's not fair. Oh, you know what? What if it's not and it's just... I could still do that. Maybe I have to just lob it up and go... No, but see, even that didn't work. What? It just bounces off her. Is this really going to be a timing thing? Like that I just have to wait till the last possible second? I think I have to. Okay. one bit, but, okay. I think it has to be that. Yeah, I can go off screen too. That's that's great. What? Oh, what? <laughs> okay. <laughs> I don't remember this being this hard as a kid. This might be one of these things that it's just, it's been so long, I don't remember how difficult it was. Or appreciated how difficult it was. Okay. Nope, that's just gonna... Okay, I got it. I haven't been able to get her once in this phase. Yeah, no, that's, that's cool. Okay, I have no idea what you have to do here. This is kind of frustrating. I tried that. Oh, 
Unless I was just slightly off, but like... Try one more time. That is so punishing. I can't believe it has to be that I have to nail a perfect explosion on it. <sighs> this last section sucks. to figure it out, but at the same time, I don't want this to go on for like half an hour. This reminds me of the, the final fight in the first game. It's just so much RNG involved. Like, she has to be over it perfectly. Say, I wanted to say. <laughs> I hate this fight, I really do. This last part is just not intuitive in the slightest. Or it's just janky. I think that's the worst part about it, is like, it despawns when it goes too high. So I can't just arc it. It has to be like a perfect hit. At least I think it does. What is this fight? <laughs> nah. I've tried throwing it with force from underneath, doesn't work. Cool, now I'm just screwed. Alright. I'm gonna see how it's done. I don't have the patience for this. 
Like, I know, I know what needs to get done, I just want to see if it's, like, a particular timing, that's all. Clearly you have to nail her with the explosion, but it just seems so picky, it's not funny. Uh, I don't even know what the problem is. I, I'm just gonna say final battle. This might be the correct one. We'll see. Okay, here we go. Yeah, this is what I'm looking for. Okay. All right. Glad I looked that up. Would not have thought of that. Yeah, I was doing the wrong thing entirely. I would not have guessed that what I'm about to do is how you're supposed to beat her. It's still picky and annoying, but okay. such a dick move, like, they make you believe that you have to hit her from below. <laughs> like, that's the answer! Yeah, throw it into the fire! So then it generates an even big, bigger flame, flame pillar, like... That's the answer. I'm so glad I looked that up. It's still pretty annoying, but at least I have a way forward now. Ah, no! <laughs> Damn it, I missed. Ah. Ah. Alright, this is the one. I've got it this time. Flames! Okay. <laughs> not, not quite done yet. I just have to not mess this up, and then we're good. Could be eight, could be nine, could be five. No, wait, not anymore. Yeah, no. It still can be eight. It still can be eight. It's eight. Oh, I'd rather spend the coins and just not have to do all that again. Ah, there it is. I find it funny that it doesn't X marks the spot, but then it starts doing that. Great! Oh, yes! Wait, there's another stage. Or is this a cutscene?
It, that looks like Wily's castle from Mega Man 2. I can't help but see that. Wait, but we got our treasure, not her. Okay. Maybe there's something afterwards, but we'll see. <sighs> That's it. That's completed 100%. I do like this one because even though you have to backtrack a little, it's different endings. So, I mean, for a Game Boy game, it's kind of impressive. And I think it's still a very good game all these years. We'll see. I don't remember the ending to it, that's the thing. Like, it's been so long since I played this. My memories of it were vague at best. So... But, yeah, I mean, it holds up. I will continue playing the rest of the series, because uh, as a kid I only had one and two. But I know that a third one came out for the Game Boy Color. Didn't have it. And then Warrior Land 4 is on Game Boy Advance. But I have both of them, so... I'll get to them at some point. I just felt the urge to play this after Pizza Tower. Just... yeah. We'll definitely do more of this later throughout the year, I think. But... I'm gonna continue playing the Zelda games as Tears of the Kingdom is, like, three months away. So, I have three months to get through the rest of the games, which I should be able to do. My plan is to hopefully... hopefully get through them before, uh, the game releases. So, it should be fun. I'm up to, uh, Oracle of Ages, I think. So, that's the Game Boy one. Which... I would have continued it last year, but I was waiting for this thing to get here because the game, you, whilst it does the job, the D-pad on that controller is just horrendous, and with this I'm using a Super Nintendo controller and it's just so good. Not only does it add extra nostalgia, but just from a comfort perspective, I think it has one of the best D-pads ever. So, meh. I don't know what else to say that I haven't said about this game in the other outros, so, yeah. If you haven't tried the series, you should. It's still worth a revisit after all these years. You know, it'd be nice if, uh, I don't know, if there was some sort of event that Nintendo was having in the near future. Um, I don't know, not specific, let's say tomorrow, that they uh, announced that you can play these on the Switch. That would, that would be nice. But that's not gonna happen, I don't think. I mean, I'm happy to eat my words, but like... There's no technical reason why it shouldn't be a thing already. It's just whatever business decision they're making. It's just... It is what it is. Truth be told, if, if they had done that expansion pack with Nintendo 64 and Game Boy instead of Nintendo 64 and Sega Genesis. I probably would have gotten it. Probably would have given me more incentive because like, whilst Nintendo 64, I have pieces of nostalgia for it. I never had the console, but I did play some of the games at friends' houses. If there would have been like a Game Boy library, I probably would have snapped that up. But oh well. All right. Hundred percent. Hundred percent. And hundred percent. Uh. What are these icons? 
Is there more to this that I don't remember? No, these are bosses. This is pointing out bosses, but what's that thing at the end? Okay. It's point. No, the there's an extra stage. Alright, hold on. I have to undock it because I have to do the cartridge reset thing. Unfortunately, this controller doesn't have the home button, so. Uh, hit it. The cartridge. Play cartridge. And redock. Okay. You see, I don't remember this. <laughs> Maybe I never 100% the game. I don't know. Oh, no, this is so... This is what it's pointing out. This this is another stage. Okay, I guess we're not done yet. I guess this is the true ending. Or maybe it's just a cutscene. Let's just see. Maybe we are done. No, I think that's just a cutscene. Or a... No, it's a door. Okay. The really final chapter. Time attack. Steal all the treasure. Whoa, what the... What the heck is- what? What's the back- what's the background? It's like something out of... WarioWare. can't go back. Okay, so this is just pretty much find the hidden path. Ah! <laughs> hidden path. Oh, this is not cool. Okay. There's no bonus stage here. I assume this is just get to the end as quick as you can. Oof. We're gonna have to watch the credits again, aren't we? Oh, this is like a tight window. <laughs> Damn it. I'm not aiming for a good time here. Like, it's, it's not going to happen. <sighs> really? Okay, hang on. What is this cycle? Like, it just doesn't line up. This is annoying. Dude. Oh my god. This is like taking me back to Crash Bandicoot and how frustrating the the cycles that don't line up that it's kind of just, well, depending on what time you get there, 
you just have to hope that it lines up, otherwise you just get punished. I'm not going to do this in a good time, clearly. It's, it's not going to happen. Wow. Like, this thing always seems to be just in the perfect position to mess me up. One way or another. Oh my god. Ugh, that was horrible. Oh no, I have to do this again. <laughs> you know what? It's all, I'll take it. Wait, but like, what now? Oh, you've got to be kidding. Okay. Oh, this stage is something. I don't think I ever did this as a kid. I, I would remember something like this. If it was this frustrating, I would 100% remember this. So I guess I never found everything. There's no way I would forget this. Visually and also just from a how hard this is point of view. Definitely would not forget this. Dude. This has turned into an NES game, all of a sudden. Or like, just one of those Mario Maker stages. Time to challenge the streamer. Okay, ugh, that room was horrible. realize what this is. I was like, this seems strangely straightforward. It's not. It most definitely isn't. I just realized what this is. I have to take this thing all the way across. already messed it up. Look, I think I have to get it through that, but maybe I need to move it. Hang on. I don't think I can get it back down, but... Okay, yep, this is gonna be fun. So this is the earliest form of, like, Mario Maker style levels. <laughs> Okay, just 
Das oh yeah, no, this is as frustrating as it looks. I thought that was the answer. I think I'm wrong. Alright, let's just go to the left. And just hope for the best, I guess. Does this follow me? Okay, looks like it does. Okay, I was wrong. This is how you do it. Let's just have a way back. Okay, this one should be okay. What's with this, like, eerie background? The mouths and, like, the frozen minions. Okay. Everything here is a platforming challenge. Oh no, this is this is not tiresome at all. Ugh. to double up on it. Okay. 
These aren't even conveyor belts. Like, what are they? Man, this is a heck of a security system when you think about it. iframes don't care. Surely I'm not losing money. It's frustrating. Okay, this is a... These were hard to do already. Uh. nothing. to be like right on the edge there otherwise it doesn't work. This isn't like a Metroid style escape, that would suck. There was no treasure though, so okay. That was uh, very involved. Ah, scripts again. I can't skip these, I'm sorry. But I guess we get to see Wario all happy and, uh... Yeah, he's carrying the massive bag of money. That stage was hard. But I most definitely did not do that as a kid. I, I would've- I would remember, like... 
the difficulty of that would be seared into my brain. There's a lot of things I remember that I would have achieved as a kid that was hard to pull off, and... If I had done this, I definitely would remember. So, I don't think I did this as a kid. So, that's cool. I got to do something that I probably never got through on my own. I suppose there might be a way to verify it, like... But... I don't know. Because I am playing... Not my original cartridge, but my original cartridge is back at home. So if the battery has survived all these years, could potentially find out, but it's too much to hassle. I, I got nothing else to say about this. Just sit, sit back and watch the cutscene. I did my closing thoughts thinking that was the end, but no, this is truly the end. I could find out what game means, though. I think it just means the minigame. It looks like it's the exact same ending as, uh... As the other one, except now you have a giant bag of money instead of the three little ones. Such happy music. <laughs> Wait a minute. Did they hear that seek revenge on me? See what happens. Oh, come on, just go through the door. <laughs> But no, uh, I suppose I should say this at the very least, uh, yeah, this was fun, in summary. One of my favorite games as a kid, so, hope you enjoyed watching the playthrough, particularly if you're on YouTube and you got as far as this. Yeah, thank you. And if you want to see me do more retro games or stuff of this nature, easiest way to let me know that is do leave a comment or, uh, just thumbs up. Plus, it also helps with all that algorithm stuff, so that's always nice, but yeah, it does let me know that people are enjoying this kind of content, so. But I do plan to do Warrior Land 3 at some point. Don't know when, but I do have a copy of it. It'll happen. Oh, so now it's challenging me to do better than 16 minutes, but that's not going to happen. But there it, there it is. I'm pretty sure that that game is just the mini game, and you can just play it whenever. So, all good. All right, chat. Uh, I'm going to take a short intermission for like two to five minutes. I'm just gonna make myself a cup of tea, and then we're gonna get onto the Stardew finale. So I'm gonna be wrapping up Stardew Valley today as well. So stick around, get yourself a snack or something. But. If you're here for Warrior Land 2, thank you so much for watching.